like the leadoff guy for March here in the bottom of the six has gotten on 11 to 10 ball game. And that brings up uh, Brian Blackwell Jr., Little B. And Little B hits a ground ball through the hole. So March, after Sean Gersich let off the inning with a hit, Little B hits a hard ground ball again. Um, but you got to play him so tight that as an infielder, you don't have really much time to react and get to the ball. So when you can run like that, you just create all kinds of issues for the defense. That brings up Angelo Alicia. Right now, if you're March, you're looking to tack on because as uh, my good friend Lane Neiman, you guys have heard me say this a few times, but Lane uh, always preached when he had the Rockers and when he helped me with Mudville that one equals two. So every run you get, they got to get two to beat you. And right now it's a one-run game. So these are huge runs here for Budweiser. They need to figure a way. And uh, there's Angelo Alicia. We talked about how he's very patient. And he walks. Now the bases are loaded. Scott Herdecki is up. Now his last time Scott came up and they had a guy on third. He had a rocket right at the third baseman. So I know Scott's going to try, you know, to make sure that he doesn't, uh, you know, either elevate the ball or put it in a spot where they can't get it. And you see there, he just he just kind of made sure he elevated. Little B jogs in, and there's a fumble, and Little B turns on the Jets, and he scores. So routine sacrifice fly to center. Again, that's the second time this game that we've seen them have some issues throwing the ball in from the outfield and securing the ball. So again, Little B took the turn. He made sure he'd look back to the infield, and as soon as he saw the ball go off the kid's glove, he turned it on and scored. Angelo, who tagged up, then went, then went to second. So two runs there, two runs there for March, so they extend the lead to 13 to 10. We go to the top of the seventh. We'll be back. And we're back. Top of the seventh here. Do or dive for Budweiser. Down a three spot. So March, that was a big bottom of the sixth there. They came out and they got a couple of guys on. And they picked up two runs and they extended the lead. And as a result of that, now uh, Sonoma, Budweiser, Sonoma, Nissan got a little work to do. And the leadoff guy swings and he hits a pop-up. Sean Gersich puts that away. And one out. So Budweiser down to their last two outs here. So these teams have played three games against each other. Budweiser won a tight one. March won a lopsided game. And now this is a close one right here. Little B jogs over. Two outs now. So now Budweiser down to their last out. Again, this is the, I believe this is the 10th place hitter. So those, those two runs in the bottom of the sixth. Oh, there's a line drive off the pitcher's glove. Danny Villarreal comes in. And, oh, the ball gets away from Israel Sanchez. The, the throw kind of took the Izzy off the bag a little bit toward the runner. And so Budweiser has life. They need one more base runner. Now they're at their top. So I think if... 27, the leadoff man can get a hit to extend this inning. Then Budweiser may, you know, th those two runs in the bottom of the six took a little air out of him. It looked like at the start, but the 10th place hitter did his job. He put it on the next guy, and there's a rocket. So Budweiser, right now, with two outs, they put on a couple of runners, so they got the tie in the batter's box with two outs. So now if you're March, you're probably going to play your outfield a little deeper. 
You're not going to want to take a chance of this guy hitting something over your head. So Budweiser with two outs here trying to mount a rally. Down three. If game for the 2017 Las Vegas Big Ball Tournament put on by the SSA of Las Vegas. And he pops the ball foul out of play. So again, you got Scotty Herdecki in right field, Little B in center, and Nate Mercado, the shortstop, due to some couple of cramps and an injury out there in left field. So again, the ball went out of play. They they rotated a new ball in there, and so here's number thirty. He swings a ground ball again. Deflected by Jibs over to first. And March Manufacturing has won the 2017 Big Ball Tournament here in Las Vegas. So we'll have the video for you guys uh, coming up uh, this week on the SSA YouTube channel. And terrific championship game. So for SSA Broadcast, Geo signing off with my cameraman Tyler. And we'll catch you soon. Thank you. Like I said, sorry about the microphone. The pitcher had a little problem there. It looked like with a contact. And there's Nate Mercado leading off with a hit. So we all got kind of fooled. We all thought it was the seventh inning there, but apparently it was not. <laughs> I have a feeling that was the bottom of the sixth. So here we go. Dave Winslow now up. He came in for Anthony Avila a couple innings ago. <laughs> and Dave runs a ball through the shortstop hole. So we've seen a few lefties on March go through that hole. And again, uh, it's it's pretty big due to the fact that Budweiser's playing with the four outfielders. So you get these guys with the good back control, and it's, uh, it's kind of like stealing. That'll bring up Israel Sanchez. Again, if you're Sonoma, you're down three. You really you got to find a way to get out. And Israel drives the ball to right, and... So Israel drove that ball deep enough and right that both runners tagged. So with one out, that's a that's a real nice job of hitting. Again, every run you get makes it tougher. So that'll bring up Denny Lawler. Now his job is you're up three. You want to get at least one of these runs in. And Denny does the same thing. He makes sure he elevates the ball. Dave Winslow running hard. Again, we've seen a couple of bobbles on throws in from the outfield. So, again, he got the third. He took a look over his shoulder. 14 to 10. March. It brings up Danny Villarreal now with two outs. At this point with that guy on third, obviously Danny trying to get a hit, but it opens up the field for him, and he can basically try to do you know, whatever he wants at this point to try to get on base and, and drive this run in. 14 to 10. And Danny swings, and he hits it through the shortstop hole. Again, last game when they went to the four outfielders, March had a big lead, and they were free swinging and driving the ball. But this game they've been taking advantage of the holes on the infield. Brings up Sean Gearsich. And Sean did the same thing he did last time up. He just pounded the ball through the open hole in the middle. So you can see here, March have been pretty good. They've been executing. They've been moving guys. They've been taking advantage of uh, opportunities to take extra bases. And again, it's really hard because a lot of these guys know how to cut and push, and they got great back control. So when you give them these holes on the infield, 
you know, they can they can punch it through when they have to. So they extend their lead to, I believe, 15 to 10 now. And Jeff Fernandez, hard ball, pitcher knocked it down. So at the end of, I believe, six and a half, it's uh, March 15 and Budweiser 10. We'll be back. And we're back. Bottom of the seventh, for sure this time. 15 to 10 March. So a big couple of runs that last inning. That makes a big di a difference when you get five run lead versus a three. So we'll see how Budweiser responds. They've been hanging in there tough this game. And there's a pop-up. Danny Lawler cruises over. That's the catch right in front of us. One out. So you can see when they were in the middle of that seven-run inning, um, the Budweiser guys were standing to the ball game. But now that they're down five here, it, uh, those last two runs m m might have sucked the last bit of oxygen out of them. So we'll see what happens here. Two strikes on the hitter, one out. He swings and he floats it out to center. Little B cruises in. <coughs> Two outs. So this is the tenth place. This is the tenth place hitter for Budweiser. Leadoff man on deck. Down five. So they're down to their last bullet here. Again, that two spot in the top of the seventh. Looked like it was a killer. Little B can't make the catch. Ball skips past them. And he cruises in. Again, we made the comment earlier. The bottom of the Budweiser lineup has done a good job of trying to rotate to the top of the order. So two outs. Again, if you're March, you're chasing out, so you don't really care about a base runner. And there's a fly ball to Scotty, and March wins the 2017 Las Vegas Big Ball Tournament. So on behalf of the SSA, I'd like to thank uh, the people here in Las Vegas, all the teams for coming out, and fantastic job by Ron Matriciano, who put this thing together. And we will be putting this video out very shortly, and we'll talk to you soon.